Hi guys, how are you all doing? How has your day been? Good evening. This is Vera. You're welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about Cora's case again, her divorce issues again. You know, before uh, or a few hours ago, I made a video concerning her div divorce issue that what could have gone wrong, what could have happened because we as we have seen them or known them as um, a happy couple. What really has gone wrong? But something else has come up. A new angle to the video or to the story has come up. Justin has gone to do a live video on his Instagram handle where he made us to know what the problem is. You know, because people have been so worried. That what could it be? What could it be? Including I, I myself, I've been like, what should that be? What, what is it that could have caused this, his intention of, um, you know, of um, wanting to divorce his wife? So now he has gone to his uh, Instagram handle to make a video and he made us know that. He is not happy. The way uh, Cora had been uh, uh, treating him, according to him, Cora had been treating him somehow. She has been cheating on him and he cannot take it any longer. He said that he has been trying to um, make the marriage work. He, he, he also said that he is a slave. He has been a slave in his own house. Can you imagine that? Like, seriously, can a, a black lady enslave a white man? Hmm. So from the look of things, he hasn't been happy the way things has been going. So he made us know that Cora had been cheating on him and is not ready to continue with that. In the video, you could hear um, Cora asking him, like, she was like, why are you doing this? He was like, repeat it. Repeat it. He said it three times. Repeat it. Oyibo man don't this. From the video, you find out that he was not happy. He was not happy. But the only problem I have with this step he has taken is the timing. You know, this woman just put to bed. You know, there's this uh, postpartum uh, depression that women, women uh, go through whenever they go to bed. But anyway, he's a doctor. You should know more than uh, me, you know, you should know that she just put to bed and he should know the dangers of what um, he's doing. But Cora too is a, is a strong woman, is a strong man. But no, notwithstanding, that is not enough for him to have done that. Now, I prefer or I feel that he should have waited later to tell her. But looking at the matter, the way it is going, it is very obvious that this guy has bottled this thing up. Probably he didn't want to say it when she was heavy. He just wants her to put to bed, to come down. Like some people say, if you come down, you do this. He wanted her to put to bed before he would just let her know his intentions. Probably he didn't want to leave her when she was pregnant. So now she has put to bed. It's time for him to go. If you can remember, in one of her videos, they made us know that they were moving to a new house. And they've just moved to a new house. So that's why people were just surprised. They just had a new child, a new baby, moved to a new house. Things are supposed to be moving, moving on well with them. But the way it is now, is a different case altogether. A different case altogether. He said Cora had been cheating on her. She has made a video before now, and most of you were like, oh, we love you, blood is your friends, and all that. But there's one thing I want people to tell her, which I'm also passing to her. One thing, that thing is faithfulness in your relationship with anybody adultery or or, or um, infidelity or what is it called cannot move your marriage forward cannot move your marriage forward at all you should tell her the truth Cora is it true did you do this if you actually did it or advise you to stop it and if you know you love your man just go and make peace with him I also believe that they can make peace yes the possibility that they will make peace is there there's always there's bound to be problem in relationships. There's problem in every relationship, not only husband and wife um, marriage that they have issues. Initially, when he came 
to announce it when he announced it that they were divorcing i thought it was because of her public life but both of them are public even him is public see now he came and said this now on the social media some people were like some people are like he shouldn't say that on social media they shouldn't be public he shouldn't have said that it's best how he comes out to let people know what he's passing through that's how people die when they bottle up things it's good to speak out somebody might say this is social media he'll get um advice where do you want him to go these are public people to the extent that they, they, they put to bed, everybody saw them. So it's as if we were there. In fact, we were there with them. <laughs> we were there with them when they when she put to bed. So they are public people, and this is how they've chosen to do it. But if they come together, so they will make it public. They, everything is public. They don't, they don't hide the way they, they live their life. Cora is a very strong girl. Um, uh, judging from the way she has been dancing, she has started her little, little dancing. And just roughly a week that she put to bed, you know, she's but no how, no matter how strong she is, she will still feel it. And I'm also advising using this opportunity to advise ladies stop cheating on your men, even the men to stop che uh, cheating on your women. It is very annoying, but men, especially, this thing is very common with men cheating. Stop it. Then, ladies that are doing it, men don't play with this kind of thing, they only take calm, they only take cheating. They hate it. Women too hate it. Some women can go as far as clean their uh, partners because of cheating. I'll advise Cora to find her level now because uh, this matter is a very sensitive matter. When the other person has cheated the other one, they are together. She just has to find her level because this is a white man we are talking about. This is not a Nigeria. This is a white man. They can blow anybody's brain anytime. Then they get that thing now. Any any time they can blow anybody's brain. But the way the man was sounding in the video, he was not happy. This man was annoyed. If you could hear her, if you watch it, you hear him telling, asking her to repeat herself, repeat it, repeat it, repeat it, as if if she repeats it, it's going to slap her. As in, like it was like, repeat it and see what I will do to you. You understand? This, this man wasn't happy, and people were not like asking him, why don't you go for DNA? Since she's sitting on you, probably. Those children are not yours. Why don't you go for DNA test? Or maybe he's suspecting that the baby is not his. Or maybe that. Like, if you even watch most of his, most of their, his, his, most of his behaviors, this Maria has been so dull. Probably because of what he bottled up that he has planned to release. You know, he has been so. He was. He has been faking it. Mm -hmm, he has been faking it all this while. Anyway, I pray that God will see them through. This thing that is happening to them happens in most marriages. I just pray that God will see them through and they will come back as one big couple that they used to be, one big happy family that they used to be. People look up to these people. Those people that are looking up to them will be so disappointed now and it's good for them to know that all with that glitters is not good. It's good for them to, to know that you can't see someone and be wishing, I wish I'm this person, I wish I'm that person. What he, she's passing through now, are you ready to pass through it? Can you send it? I just wish them well. I pray for them that God will see them through and let them come together because I won't lie to you. I used to love the way too. they used to do things together. It's good for husband and wife to join hands together and do something together. But for them to now come up and start announcing their separation or their divorce is so disappointing. So, you know, I came to make this video to clear the air because I was like, what went wrong? So we have known what went wrong. Cora cheated on her husband. According to the husband, he said that she cheated on him and she has been treating him like a slave and he's not ready to take this anymore. Thank you very much. Like, come your way next time. If you are seeing me for the first time, subscribe, please. Subscribe. I like to do this. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. When you do this, you're supporting me. And if you have been watching my videos in the, from the or in the past, I'm also appreciating you. If you've not been doing that, I won't be, be encouraged to come and do more videos. Thank you very much. I'll call your way next time. Bye.